any amount of dust. Okay, so today we are going to the Bidar Fort. Bidar Fort was built in the 8th century and it was once again reconstructed in 1436 I think 1436 or 1426 that was by the Bahamani dynasty the Bahamani kings let's see what it has to offer cruising on the open highways like this is something that I love to do I'm not a great fan of off-roading I see a signage which says Bidar 30 kilometers. Bidar is not too far from Adabad. Oh, this is a sugarcane field. I heard so much about the Bidar Fort. It is supposed to be a nice place. Something a little similar to the Golconda Fort that we have here in Hyderabad. It has got about 30 structures within the 5 km radius of the fort. It's got tombs, it's got mosques, gardens, paddy, no no, sugar can <laughs> Excuse me. We have got off the highway, that's the Mumbai highway, and taken a ride from there. This place is like the border of three states. A little ahead you have Maharashtra, we uh, right now in Telangana and then we will be going to Karnataka so the people living around this place can speak Telugu, Marathi, Kannada, Urdu ok so we are officially entering Karnataka that's the boat As soon as we got into Bidar, the road seems to have become much better. So the Bidar Fort is 8 kilometers from here and the Gurudwara 11 kilometers. Okay, let's go. The landscape seems to be changing again. So we are the only two riders on this road right now. <laughs> I love this empty road. This road belongs to us. Yeah. It looks like this is the wall of the Bidar Fort.
understand there are about 30 structures within this fort but unfortunately I think due to COVID most of them are locked Thank you. 